Hello everyone, it's Dr. Desiree Alexander, aka Educator Alexander, and here is your five minute tip for this week. So if you are a Zoom user like I am and your Zoom is updated, you have noticed many more buttons and cool tools that you can use in Zoom. But if you're not using summary and AI companion and whiteboards and notes, and you want some of your other stuff to show up again, this is how you turn off some of these buttons. Let's get started. So I'm going to end this meeting and I'm actually going to go to my Zoom account online. So the first thing you would think is to go to settings, but I'm not going to go to settings. I'm going to scroll down and go to account management. And under account management, I'm going to go to account settings. So when I go to account settings, you'll notice that there's many different settings, including AI companion. Then if you scroll down, whiteboarding notes. So let's look at how to take these off if you're not going to be using them. So for AI Companion, you'll see this little button under each little section or most of the sections that say as shown in meetings toolbar. So I'm going to turn that off. I'm going to turn this one off. And of course, you can keep on the ones you want to use. They can also be hidden in team chat. Scrolling down, I want to take that off. And that's in the composer toolbar, but I want to take it all off because I'm not using it. And then I'm going to go down and go to whiteboard and I'm going to disenable the whiteboard with the button at the top and the same thing with notes. So now when I go here and go to a meeting, those buttons are gone. Yay! So again, it's just the ones if you're not going to use them. And notice I have a little bit more space here and all I have is this over here. So if you want to kind of control your toolbar a little bit more, that is how you do it. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel. And good luck.